world what's good cryptocurrency fans out there welcome back to the everything all coin channel today we're going to be talking about maha dao's first incubated project and if you guys don't remember maha dao it was actually poker starter's first ipo that came out and had everyone excited about poker starter because how well maha dao did right and their first incubated project will be called scallop right uh, now this is looking like a it's going to be a great project um, basically it's the world's first fca regulated DeFi bank right and it has DeFi and nft as a bank right we're going to look more into it but before we get into talking about that i would like to ask you guys to subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already we're on the road to 10k subscribers so if you guys would like to be a part of the 10k subscriber giveaway hit that red subscribe button don't forget to like the video comment anything in the comment section down below and most importantly is hit that bell button to get notified every time i upload a new video and lastly check out the description down below for the discord and the patreon remember guys the patreon has a new tier regarding private sales and we actually covered a project that we in the we in my community we actually got into this as a private sell investor stage right so if you guys want to get a chance to get into projects like this early on join the patreon and let's get right into it guys so maha dao's first incubated project as you guys can see will be scallop right go on to their website their website looks very clean has a lot of information on their website and this actually has some decent backers also right and partnerships you, sh you sh could say with a few uh, crypto projects that is already out and some decent VCs behind them, right? So as you guys can see, it's the world's first DeFi power fiat account. Scallop is an innovate, innovative fintech ecosystem for users that want faster and more efficient way to securely manage their crypto fiat all in one single place, right? So scrolling down a little bit here, right? So it's going to be banking as a service as the way it should be. Scrolling down some more. Now, this is the, the pretty important part. We get into the important parts of Scallop right now. The key features on why Scallop is very good. You know, you got store crypto and fiat all in one place. The thing about this is they're going to have their own exchange, um, your accounts, debit cards, things like that. That's going to be looking to be happening from Scallop themselves, right? So you're going to have access from, you're going to have access to DeFi from a fiat account. And that is very good, a very quick on ramp and off ramp for a lot of people you know you get to keep control of your keys our wallet is secure but with the cc ela6 plus secure element secure java os and scrolling down some more right you got scallop earn DeFi rewards on uh, fiat deposits so earn the best rates from D uh, DeFi protocols like compound Aave, with the all the utility and none of the complexity and then you get trade your NFTs here with, you know, they got their little NFT bank, right? So trade NFTs with Fiat for the first time. Buy, sell, and leverage digital uh, digital content using built-in NFT marketplace sync with accounts, providing extra layer of security and peace of mind. So they're going to have NFTs here. We already know a lot of people is getting into NFTs as of right now. This is pretty big, right? Then you got the Fiat currency meets native tokens exchange crypto and DeFi tokens to fiat and vice versa through a direct link to uniswap for you uh seamless trading that is very good right so you got a direct link to uniswap for seamless trading making everything easy for onboarding new users um people that aren't even like experiencing crypto they can use scallop and it will be very easy for them right so you got the scallop coin here which is going to be an erc20 token but they are built they are looking to build on substrate so them having a little bit of connection to poke dot is very good right empires the it empowers the whole scallop ecosystem the the ticker symbol is sclp has multiple uses um basically here are the uses for tr receiving trading bonuses payment and much more you can stake you can stake your scallop tokens to an open account and access services payment of transaction fees transaction fees exchange fees and monthly occurring monthly management fees actually so you can sl uh, click here for the tokenomics on there if you want to look into more right then you got your global fiat account so you can open a gb a gbp and iban account using used for daily use um, for both personal and business users, you got over multi 15 multiple currency fiat wallets 
which can accumulate interest to scallop earn and right? give you that passive rewards and like i told you guys you're gonna have scallop debit cards here so you got your scallop cards right and they're gonna be there they're basically gonna be titanium metal cards for elite uh, elite members so i'm assuming it's probably the black one and the blue one would be the regular one right scrolling down you got the scallop payment you can send and receive fiat and crypto in one click so everything will be done and managed on this one app i'm assuming how that will work right and that's pretty good like i said this is very good for new users right then here you go you got the scallop hardware wallet right you got full control of your crypto and your keys right you can store and trade your crypto using scallop cold wallet it's kind of looked like the binance um i forgot the name of the hardware wallet but it does look good though it kind of looks like that got a look little screen here um pretty cool interface there so and then of course you got regulated secured and insured and this is what i was talking to you guys about so you're gonna have scallop chain right the next generation of cross-chain banking platform so scallop chain is going to be a substrate based um blockchain that that powers a suite of cross-chain financial applications in the polka dot ecosystem and that is very big i like that scallop plans to connect traditional banks with cross-chain uh, cross blockchain applications institutional partners work directly with scallop allowing them to create secure custody services interest bearing sir uh, bearing savings account debit cards and fiat on ramp to crypto this is very big right here um especially as uh we get more adoption here in the crypto space scallop will become bigger in the future this is that's a big thing right there you got your global account so you got the roadmap here uh where are we we are in july we we at the end of july essentially again legal things uh uh nope wrong one actually sorry and they actually don't even have it all all updated or is it all channeled up right now that i can see because we should be seeing july 2021 here um, they, they do got to update this roadmap. It looks like they definitely got to update this roadmap uh, Because I don't see July here. I might be blind. I don't know uh, But yep, we got your core team members here uh, Raj as the founder and we got Mindy as the co-founder. You also got the advisory team um, A lot of fintech people here and then you got Winston Wolf and DeFi. I think that's a uh, influencer right there and of course you got lester um so that means you know you might know exactly what um vc is going to be behind this if you see lester there All right so scrolling down a little bit we already talk, talked about this being incubated by maha dao so with lester here guess what you want to have here you want to have x21 All right au21 capital x21 digital All right magnus capital um amstein capital but for the crypto projects that they are actually partnered with, you got Maha Dow, North Finance, and Unilend. A lot of people love the Unilend, so this is going to be a very big partnership. Of course, Maha Dow was the first Polka Starter IDO. So with that being the first Polka Starter IDO, could Scallop actually have ties to it being the first? Well, not being the first, but being an IDO on Polka Starter itself. I don't know. So we don't know where this is technically going to launch yet. But my suspicions is just because Maha Dao was the first project to come off of uh, Pokestarter, um, we might potentially see Scallop actually launch on Pokestarter also. I don't know. That's just my little thought. But let me know what you guys think. How you guys feel about um, Scallop so far? Did you guys like everything you see? This is like I told you guys, this is actually a project that we got into on the private cell, me and the team members, right? So if you guys wanted to get into that, of course, I told you get into the uh, get into the Patreon, right? So that's pretty much the video for you guys. Let me know what you guys think. Leave your thoughts in the comment section down below. And of course, if you guys haven't subscribed already yet, please do so. We're on a road to 10K subscribers. So if you guys would like to help out with that, hit that red subscribe button. Don't forget to like the video, comment, anything in the comment section down below. And most importantly, is hit that bell button to get notified every time I upload a new video. And I'll check you guys later. Peace, YouTube.